to get started, you're going to go down here into the search box and you're going to type in services. And then you're going to select services. Once services is open, go ahead and scroll all the way down until you find Windows Search. You're going to go ahead and right click, select stop. Once it's done, go ahead and right click again, go to properties. And then here under startup type, go ahead and select disabled. Click apply and click OK. This is something that runs all the time and is quite unnecessary. When you're done with Windows Search, go ahead and scroll up until you find Remote Desktop Services. Here you're going to do the exact same thing. Right click, select Stop. Once the service is stopped, go ahead, right click again, select Properties, and then go ahead under Startup Type, select Disabled. Then click Apply, and then click OK. Remote Desktop Services allows other computers to remotely connect to your computer. Turning this off not only is a safety feature, but it also helps your computer run faster. When you're done with remote desktop services, you're gonna scroll down until you find SysMain. Here you're gonna do the same thing. Right click, select stop. Once it is done, go ahead, right click and go to properties. And then under startup type, you're gonna select disabled. Go ahead, click apply and then click okay. SysMain is an outdated process that remembers things that you do with your computer that is supposedly to help it run faster over time. What it ends up doing is it ends up bogging your system and slowing it down over time instead. So disabling this will end up making your computer run faster. When you're done with SysMain, you can go ahead and close this window. Now go down into the search and type in update. And then select check for updates. Once the Windows Update tab is open, you might be prompted to update your computer. If this is the case, go ahead and pause the video and update your computer now. Once your computer is up to date, go ahead here and click on Advanced Options. Here in Advanced Options, you want to make sure that everything is turned off. Once you have all these boxes turned off, go ahead and select Delivery Optimization. Here on the Delivery Optimization tab, you want to make sure that you turn off Allowed Downloads from Other PCs. What this does is allow other computers outside of your network to connect to your network to get Windows updates. It's supposed to make it quicker for everybody, but all it does is spy on you and make your computer slower. Once you've got that turned off, you can go ahead and close the tab. And the last thing you're going to want to do is go back down to the search here and type Startup. And then select Startup Apps. Here in this tab, you're going to want to turn off everything that you do not want turning on with your computer. If you're not sure which things to disable and which things not to disable, go ahead and go on to Google and just ask what it is and if it's okay to turn it off or not. Basically, you want to turn off all the programs that you're not going to be using when you turn on your computer. If it's something that you use all the time, as soon as you turn on your computer, then just leave it on. But things like games and music, go ahead and just disable all that stuff. You'll turn it on when you're ready to use it. When you're done, go ahead and close out the window and you're good to go. Well, that's it, everybody. It's as easy as that to get your computer running a little bit faster again. If this video helped you out at all, don't forget to smash that like button and subscribe to my channel. We'll see you all next time. And remember, don't be toxic. Spread positivity.